Give me a minute. I'm, I'm in the library right now. I know, but I was wondering if I could take a picture of you for my photography project. This scene is just so beautiful. Yeah, sure. Okay, great. Um, okay. Well, what should I do? Just, just stay right there. I think. Okay. okay. Thank you. Yeah, of course. Um, and uh, yeah, and actually, I think I feel like I've actually maybe met you from somewhere that night in the stairwell. What? When I was on the phone with my mom. No. I think you're thinking of someone else. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably. Actually, sorry about that. I probably my memory. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Of course, I recognize oh. you. Oh God. Okay. Gosh, I thought it was. Oh my God. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, I just kind of wanted to apologize for that night. I think I was pretty rude, and no, it's I was just so out of it, you know, my grandmother and everything. Yeah, it, it's fine. It's totally okay. fine. Yeah. Okay. Well, is it is it all right if I sit down? Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Um, what's her name? Jasmine. Yeah. What's what's yours? Ruth. Okay. That's such a pretty name. Um, <laughs> if, if you don't mind me asking, why did you want to talk to me that night on the staircase? <laughs> um. I think it's just because, because I heard that you said you, you couldn't talk to your grandma or see her, 
and you look so upset. So I just want to comfort you. That's all. Thanks. That's that's really kind of you. <laughs> um. So your grandma lives in China. Yeah, yeah. She lives in in Guangzhou. And when was the last time you saw her? Gosh, it's probably like six years ago. It's been a really really long time. Yeah, yeah and I. I guess it's just really upsetting to me because I've never, my Chinese is just, it's so, so bad and I've never really been able to talk to her and interact with her in that way. And I guess I'm just really scared that she's going to forget, you know, all the little pieces and memories that we have together and, you know, what, what if she doesn't remember me at all? And I don't know, I, I'm just, I'm really upset by that, I guess. And, you know, my mom can always talk to her, but it's never really going to be the same, you know. I can help you. Ya 老老四岁就进了戏班子
have something exciting to tell you. But yeah, I mean, what is it? I got the fellowship. So that means I have something to expect this summer. Wow, <laughs> that's amazing. Wow, you wanted that for so long too. Yes. Oh my God, I'm so proud of you. Good job. Thank you. <sighs> Is everything okay? Yeah, no, I, um... Actually, I wanted to tell you something, too. Um... My, um... My grandma, she passed away. I, I don't even know how to thank you. No, thank you. Oh, I, Bruce, I can't. I want you to have it. Promise me to read it. Yeah, of course I will. Dear Jasmine, you know I'm better at expressing thoughts through writing than speaking, so here I am writing this letter to you. During these past few months with you, I've had some of the best, most meaningful moments of my life. I'm so glad that I was able to help bridge the gap between you and your grandma and at least somewhat help you get to know her. I know it was hard for you to feel that level of closeness that would have been there if it weren't for the physical and language barriers, but just know that she left this earth with a deep, unwavering love for you. Even if her own life and memory were becoming more and more unclear as time went on, that love was still there. I'm sure of it. And. Do you remember how she'd always talk about how much love and passion she had for acting and wish she could have kept pursuing it? I believe in you, Jasmine. Just know that you have something special and you can't let it go. You can't let it go. She said that every week. Jasmine, you're still so young and have so much time to try things. So. At least give your dream of acting a shot for your grandma. I know she would have been so thrilled if she could see you act. You can carry on her dream. You can at least try. Don't forget me, and don't forget this, Ruth. Jasmine. Yeah. That's me. We're ready for you.
I can go whatever I want.